Uh, we're starting a little late today. You'll never guess why. Because for two hours, two hours, my trusty sidekick, Ryan Katsu Rivera, a man who is half Puerto Rican and half Japanese, fiddled with the soundboard trying to understand why there was an echo coming from the speakers. Two hours later, two hours later, this show's 42 minutes. We could have done two shows in that time. Two hours later, he goes, oh, wait a minute. I was playing video games, you know, little games that little kids play. I was playing video games, and I plugged in the TV to the speaker. That's what you're hearing. Unplugs uh, it, everything's back to normal. It would have gone a lot faster if people that were competent picked up my calls yeah, when I called there. them. It's the technician's fault. It's CR. Oh, sorry, Blaze TV. Blaze TV. What's the matter with you? You can't. You. We have to be better at telling Ryan that he played video games last night at the studio. He's in be the studio. Better. Be, be better. Show. Be He's better. Like, be better. I'm gonna sit at Gavin's desk and play video video games. What is the matter with you? You have your own apartment now. You go. You leave your apartment on the weekend to go see your Grammy and your Grampy. They're the best. Grow up. Move out. You don't even have a chest of drawers. Do you even have underwear at your house? Uh, I had to buy yes. you toilet paper. But I, I did bring toilet paper. You brought one roll. That's, mm. You know who buys one roll of toilet paper and not a bunch? A heroin addict. Well, somebody that doesn't poop a lot also. I try to keep that on the... On the low. By the way, heroin addicts don't go to the bathroom very much. Oh, I see, yes. <sighs> It's just, it just breaks my heart because it's not just Ryan. We're talking about the entire generation, and that's the future of this, this country, is these wrinkled teenagers, these man babies. Who, I could not wait to move out of the house at 18. You know what we did? We were punk rockers. We'd find the guy with the most normal hair, and he'd tuck, tuck the blue hair in a hat. He'd wear a suit. He'd rent the house. Here you go, sir, first and last deposit with a suit on. And then 20 of us would move in. I'd, I'd, we had a bed. I slept in the dining room for a while. I slept in the basement next to the boiler. And we would all adjust our rents based on how many people. No one had their own room. And it was just like a barracks, a military barracks. So we had a house that was probably, you know, the modern equivalent of like 3000 bucks. I'm doing modern uh, pricing to, to help you out. Um, and no one paid more than maybe 200 bucks. Like, t you're 29 and you move out at 29? Well, I'm, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm taking care of them. They're taking care of me. It's, uh, it's a lovely... What do you mean you're taking care of them? You wipe their ass? And that, that, that's a lie, no. Ryan. That's a lie. You're taking care of them. If someone needs to be taken care of, then they have to be there. You have to be there every day. Well, no, I mean like uh, shoveling the driveway, taking out the garbage, doing stuff on the roof. You know doing stuff on the roof. Yes. You did roof repairs this weekend. No, hanging Christmas lights and uh, <laughs> dangerous stuff that uh, older men shouldn't be doing. All right, well, that's a half-decent explanation. I went to my grandparents' house because I didn't want my, my grandfather up on a ladder putting up Christmas decorations. Yeah, I got all my stuff there. And before renting, you know, in the city, it, upstate, there's no place to rent. Either you, you buy a home or you just... Or you live in Newburgh. There's tons of apartments in every little town. It's called the downtown. No. Well, Google it. I'll bring you there one day. It, it's, it's trees, forest, Well, then woods. move into the city. Move to Brooklyn. Move to the I Bronx. Did. Oh, well, not there. But well, you should have moved out of uh, upstate New York when you were 18. Well, I can't do anything about that now. So I all I could do I'm is... I'm not asking you to get a time machine. I'm yelling at you. Oh. I'm insulting you. Well, that, uh, yeah, I get that. But, I'm I mean, not I'm... trying to fix anything. I'm mad. It's sort of like, you know, you're mad that it's raining out. You're not going to stop the rain from falling. I'm just saying, look at this That's goddamn true. rain over here who just cost me two hours. Rain. You're rain. Rain Ryan. Rain. Rainin. Rain. Rain Katsu Rivera. Rain Katsu Rivera. Uh, date